Mississippi News Update. We have new details at the back gate. Traffic backed up at all sides of the intersection, but construction crews are on scene trying to fix the problem. Will Whitson is live on the scene. He's got more details on why work is taking so long. Well, Theo, the 17 bypass in Faro, you've really got a domino effect of things happening, all thanks to one traffic signal pole being down. Now, take a look over here at work crews. They're trying to put this signal, crew, signal pole back up. The uh, original pole was knocked down about 4.45 this morning. It, in turn, shut off all the traffic lights at this intersection. That's why you've got these guys, Myrtle Beach Police, directing traffic on all sides. Now, while they're keeping traffic moving, it's still a general slowdown from what you would normally see at the back gate. Now, because of those work crews in the middle of the intersection, folks can't turn left from either side, and that's causing a huge headache for drivers. If you take a look down here, traffic is moving pretty smoothly, but all day when it gets backed up, I've seen cars realize that they can't turn left here. In fact, you can see one car trying to make a U-turn right now. That would be fine, except you have other intersections here. And while I haven't seen any major accidents today, it has caused a big traffic headache. Now, repair crews, they are on scene, but it's going to take several more hours to get this signal pole up and working and lights working again. That's in part due to the fact that these crews, they had to come down from North Carolina. I'll explain why in a live report at 5 o'clock. Live in Myrtle Beach, Will Whitson, WMBF News.